Hello and welcome to Kindred Spirit Tarot. So this is the video. I tried twice yesterday to get this video out and it just wasn't successful. So I gave up in the end. thought I'll do it this morning. And I've actually been awake this morning since 3.30. But it's okay because I was able to um, have a good conversation with a very special friend of mine from across the pond. <laughs> so Living Light Illuminated by Elizabeth Eagle and Grace Butler. We are not alone. This is dedicated to all light workers and spiritual warriors who are working together peacefully to raise the vibration of our collective consciousness. So for those of you that missed yesterday, I'll just give you a quick look. I've signed formula by both ladies. And here is Kindred Spirit Tarot with this light being that came out from the corner by the candle and floated all the way across and landed on the unicorn's nose and elizabeth um, slows this down and captures it frame by frame so i'll hold this like this for you see if we can get so you can see the book illustrations are fabulous the written work is fabulous by both ladies. Is it just all on light orbs? There's um, comparing it to um, to cells. Even finding orbs in Hollywood movies. This is a bit like the one on Kindred Spirit Tarot by one of my particular favourite characters from Wizard of Oz. Who doesn't love that film? And here too, on Doreen, Doreen Virtue. <laughs> yep, here we have all different cells, bacteria and algae looking very similar to the orbs there's also a part on sacred geometry which I find extremely fascinating and one of my favorite subjects ever crop circles And the Curlian photography, which absolutely shows that energy just comes off even the most inanimate object. Here we have a key. And it's showing you all that energy that comes off. So we can imagine what's actually coming from us, guys. What we are beaming out there. Isn't that fabulous? You won't be disappointed with the illustrations, that's for sure. So I believe this book is available on Amazon. Of course, you can get in touch with um, Elizabeth. She has a, a website. It's um, www.livinglight, sorry, livinglightbeings.com. I will leave um, a note in the description box for you. Um, and also you can get in touch with Grace Butler on her YouTube channel. It's absolutely full of information and I just guys you just won't be disappointed. And Elizabeth and Grace on the back. My two wonderful friends. And Grace, thank you very much your wonderful surprise I'm going to share with everyone because I can't help it <laughs> Grace also does these outstanding pictures in a, she frames them they are glossy pictures comes in a cellophane wrap so if you get in touch with Grace you can purchase these yourself I, I'm, I'm telling you guys once you get hold of these you will not be able to stop looking at them everyone is individual there are no two the same 
And I love this one. Can you see that face in there? I'm trying to do it without the light reflecting off it. I've got two eyes, a nose and a Mexican moustache peering at you. Look at this one with the movement in it. Absolutely fabulous. And I believe Grace has, has one that turns up with the same characteristics all the time. Um, that she's even given him the name of Harry. <laughs> and thank you, Grace, for this too. This is an album absolutely full of pictures of orbs. I'm going to share this with you too. This is one on the front. Doesn't that look like the Vesica Pisces? Or the, um, the Mandala in my Healing Light Tarot? where we have the circle going one way and the circle going the other and you get that shape in the middle that we call the Divine Feminine Gateway, the, the Healing Gateway. Isn't that just fabulous? And so we have all of these wonderful photographs of orbs look at the movement in this one i don't think this camera is doing it justice to be fair the colors are just phenomenal and thank you so much grace for sending this to me because i just cannot stop looking at them <laughs> So much movement and colour. And aren't some of them just like gossamer wings? It's almost like a trumpet. <laughs> And they don't just come up individually. Again, you can see that some of them come in groups. They're on just no two the same. Everyone is completely individual. I like this one when you hold it the other way, which is the way it was intended, but I've turned them round the other way so that they don't fall out on the floor when I'm showing you. Doesn't it look like a cape? <laughs> gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. And on this one, Grace says she often sees this figure of eight, the infinity sign, the, the lemonscape there, we can see. And this one just reminds me of, you know, when you swim over a coral reef, over coral, you can, it's like you can see it through the water, but the water's clear, but you, you're still kind of looking through water. And this too, like gossamer wings, like the wings of a fairy. Aren't they beautiful? I really have to congratulate you, Grace, on photographing these orbs. Beautiful, beautiful camera work. So order some of these guys from Grace. I promise you you will not be disappointed they are just simply simply gorgeous grace also was very kind enough to send me some poems that she has uh, written or channeled as she says and i've chosen one that i'm going to share with you i really felt some resonance with it and it's called not fully human 
by Diane Grace Butler. Actually, Diana Grace Butler. I don't see myself as fully human. So many humans are looking for a spiritual experience. But if we only knew, we are a spirit and we are having a human experience. And if us humans also knew the wants and desires of our own spirit, then we would see with spirit's eyes and not hold to all that's human, where our emotions rule the day. We would be beyond pleasure or pain. We would be beyond right or wrong. We would be beyond good or bad. And we would be beyond time or space. We would not even worry about the human race. Wow, well, I really hope you've enjoyed this little video, guys. And I hope that you find the book informative. And I really hope that you get in touch with Grace too. Get some of these fabulous pictures of these light beings that she is capturing. Oh, outstanding. Well, thank you for joining me, and I'll speak to you very soon, my friends. Goodbye.